I'm just taking a good picture, George. Welcome good to luck. the 20-year class reunion. Good we hope yeah. that all of you here tonight will not get too drunk because the police protection promise won't be here. Is that a little tie from 1961, George? That happens to be a new style of tie. I'm the only guy here with an on. you are wearing something different, I understand. <laughs> Fred, say something. Introduce yourself. I'm a little bit bored. <laughs> Introduce yourself. Fred Jasper's way over there to see you. Are you the Big Ten official that we've heard so much about? Or you too. You too. We've, you too. We've, we've seen it. And Catherine, we want to thank you for doing such a fine job of organizing this reunion. Catherine, who? Well. Full name. Full name. Oh, this is really Social Security good. number. Okay. Place of employment. You're already quite Same fascinated name. by this, aren't you, Catherine? Oh, I know we were right. Actually, you've been in front of the camera since I got on here. In five years, we're going to look back at this. Catherine, where do you work? At the area seminar in Waverly. What do you do? I'm in the uh, administrative secretary. <laughs> Come here, girl. <laughs> we were on. You were on. You were on again. You were on again. Bonnie, where do you work? Um, Parker. And what do you do? Oh, that's a bad question. <laughs> Business, religion, and art departments, and security department. Business, religion? Both. Oh, I thought art it was a new yeah. cult. <laughs> <laughs> no? oh. Where do you work? I work in What do you teach them? Yeah, they walk nice things. Look at the camera. You can tell them precisely what you're teaching the youth of America. We what want to know in five years. Precisely what I'm teaching That's you. right. You yeah. won't turn out like George Davey. Oh. Yeah. Run a close-up, Bob. I want to find out what the educators of today are doing for the children of tomorrow. Miriam, though. Miriam, got your chance. Do you stress the basics? Yes, I do. I think we need more of that. But if you don't have the basics, you're not going to make it. Well said. Thank you, Bob. All right. Now let's see. Bill, we'd like to find out where you're living right now. I'll turn it on. And what are you doing? Working for Buffalo. And what do you do there? I'm a national field supervisor for pneumatic products. What does that mean? <laughs> what kind of work do you do? What kind of? Uh, it's banking equipment. I see. So you nice travel? Yeah. Oh, Where? Oh. Where have you been in the last 30 days? Uh, Brownsville, Texas, New Orleans, Dallas, Houston. Wow. Get around a little bit. You got your passports with you? Yeah. Not Good. With you me. may need it to get out of Bremer County. <laughs> Not with me, but I have one. Okay. We're going to view this in five or ten years from now, okay. and we'll look back. Look in the camera now. <laughs> Tell everybody happy 1981, and we'll see them again in 86. Okay. Happy 1981. We'll see you in 86. John Holmes, <clears throat> step in here. John, tell us what you're doing right now. Uh, I work for the uh, phone company in New England Talent Okay. Then what do you do? Uh, central office uh, technician. Oh. How could I resist it in a couple okay. of hours? Right? How long have you lived out there? Uh, it's about 13 years now. 13? I'm doing great, yeah. Now we got a Okay. So let's go to home. <laughs> Mark, tell us what you're doing right now. Oh, Chief, this is way away. How long have you been chief? Three and a half years. Three and a half years. Three and a half years. What do I see you driving around town in? I decided. Squad to car. Squad <laughs> car. <laughs> Who's that sticking his head out of the back of the squad yeah, that's car? That's my little boy, Jeffy. How old is he? Uh, he's two and a half. Two and three quarters. Almost three. Does he get everything he wants, Art? Just about. Just about. <laughs> he goes until Dad runs out of money, and that takes one trip. <laughs> Six. I wanted to get a shot of you. Would you bring your wife up, please? Karen? Karen? My wife, Karen. How is it living with Art? <laughs> the best she's ever had. Know that I almost lived with Art in his 51 Chevy for two years. I'm surprised you got to ride in it. Well, I ride it. Okay, do you want to go for a ride? Turn around and you brush your butt off. And you we didn't even talk, told her about the ride over the hill. Over the hill? Coming off Cedar Lane, just about into the drink. <laughs> on Thanksgiving Day, when both of us were late. Oh, I remember that. Uh, when you said, here we go. <laughs> a little slippery that day. A little slippery, yeah. 
Brian. Nice to see you again. How are you? Joni, how are you? Fine. I think we talked about that 10 years ago, didn't we? Yeah. I'm sure we must have. You look like a big gamer. Yeah, that's right here. Bonnie. And uh, yeah. what we're trying to do. Right? You were supposed to introduce yourself. Oh, Brian Kruger. <laughs> what we're doing is we're trying to see how good we look today so that at the 50 year reunion when we play this back and they wheel us in, we'll feel pretty good about it. Do you have any? Oh, I see. He's got a recorder too. Yeah. Okay. We're going to uh, make sure we oh, wow. okay. get a brief statement from everybody. I'm very observant. If nothing more than just a hello, we wanted to get everybody on. Glad you could make it. Where do you live now? Springfield, Ohio. How long have you been there? Well, wow, 12 years in Ohio, four years where we're at. Right. What do you do? Teach all day yeah. all day yeah. day. Oh, oh, day. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you for coming. And my wife, Bart. And what else do you want to know? <laughs> huh? I want to hear what you threw across the room in Gerard's chemistry class. A 32 pound lake trout. <laughs> No, no, come on, sir. Sure. You are in this. Would you want to work? It's hard. My day for the night. <laughs>